Are you hosting a New Year's Eve party but not sure how to start planning? Well, the Bite Me More sisters, Julie Albert and Lisa Nat, are here with some unique ideas. Welcome, ladies. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. All right, so, so what's the first step in planning one of these parties? Well, the first step, especially with New Year's, you don't want to drop the ball. So what kind of party do you want to have? Are you naughty uh -huh. or are you nice like my sister? <laughs> you know, I'm more about looking back and doing the whole anti-resolutions thing, last hurrah. And so this party is all about that. Now, would it's you say the theme follows the menu or the menu follows the theme? It's that's a good question. That's a very good that question. Um, I would say the theme and then the menu. Theme and then the menu. So, yeah. So this looks like a... Party that if you're would going be, for debauchery, this is it. If you <laughs> have, if you feel at home in Trump Tower, yes, this is the menu and the party for you. <laughs> this is absolutely the party. Okay, for you. so let's talk about what we have here. Well, we've got the Dirty Shirley, mm -hmm. which is a take on the classic Shirley Temple. Just put in a little vodka, and it makes it Lovely. super dirty. Mm -hmm. We've got French onion soup, cheesy, comfort, homey, yummy food. Again, another comfort food favorite. Mac and cheese balls, or bites, okay. rather. Um, this looks like the most decadent thing I've ever seen. What is are, that? Those are X-rated brownies. Okay. Um, so this is a family-friendly show, so I, I'm not sure I can tell you how delicious they are, That's, but um, cookie dough at the bottom, like a chocolate chip cookie layer, uh, Oreos, caramel, score bar. You've got it all. Yeah, you got it all. You've and then, got it all, and then baby. this looks like something I want to eat right now. Yeah, because chips really need help in that yes. department. You need to make them more delicious. Yes. So here we've coated them in caramel, chocolate, and sea salt. Now, so how did you pick the menu for all this? So this you could go in a lot of directions for well, the sort of no resolutions party. No resolutions should be all about decadence and mm. fun. About Hello? decadent? Yeah. <laughs> Mm, Are you coming to my party? For I know, I, I, you might party. want to come to my party. I will, party. but let's finish up here for a second. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I just got comfortable here. <laughs> yeah, who doesn't want to mm. come to my party? It's fantastic. Cheers. So, so, so how do you pick it? How did you decide what, what makes it on the menu? It's things that can be made in advance mm -hmm. or um, very easy to put together very little time um, as far as effort and energy goes. And having fun little things like the, the fake dollar bills. Yeah. That's always just, add. Yeah. You know, <laughs> if you're going to make it a party, make it a great one. All right, well, let's let's see if there's a great party going on on well, this side of the table. I, I, think, it my I, party. Think, I think there's a pretty good party happening over mm -hmm. here because we're starting out with a roasted marshmallow martini. So I'm pretty sure I've got you yeah, there. No, you, you, yeah, you had me hooked. <laughs> OK, so what's in so, that one? Um, well, we have creme de coco, we have marshmallow flavor vodka, we have vanilla vodka. You know what, I, this, 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 I know. there's talking and there's doing, right? So let's just do, shall we? All right. And we've roasted marshmallows. <laughs> how Smooth. how so good is that good. first thing in the morning? <laughs> Come back to my party. I've oh, got there's a little. Over here. So there's a, definitely a toast theme here. There is a toast theme happening here. So if we've... you had told me, sorry, I don't mean to interrupt. If you told me I was going to a party with a toast theme, yeah, I don't know that I would have thought this is going to be a great party. But so it <laughs> looks fantastic. Well, yeah, really inventive. We like to have fun with our food, so you know, just make it fun, little bites. Mm -hmm. um, so we first have a uh, uh, meatball on a toasted rice cake. So just toast it up and serve it. It's one biter. Um, then we had the idea of doing a bruschetta bar. So instead of doing the regular, you know, mm -hmm. piece of bread toasted, we went for a whole bunch of vegetables, a little bit of health in here for your New Year's resolution, unlike yeah. the party well, over she's there. toasting 2017, <laughs> I'm stuck in 2016. <laughs> <laughs> um, over here we have a tomato soup with grilled cheese croutons. Lovely. And uh, finally we have cinnamon toast Banana cupcakes. Oh, my goodness. Okay, that's one of the best cereals in the world. I know. And I to think. put it with a cupcake, how good is that? That is fantastic. Um, now let me ask a question. Regardless of the theme, yes. is champagne appropriate to ring in the new year? Would you yeah, do that? I mean, that, I that's absolutely. like a good glass of yeah, champagne. I, you'll never hear us say no to a festive cocktail. So, yes. Yes. Um, Am I going for the dirty Shirley over the champagne? Mm -hmm. I think I am. And lastly, what time is it appropriate to start kicking people out of your house after, after the, the, you've rung in the new year? Well, we're going to have two different answers. Okay, here. I want to hear this. Mine is um, after breakfast. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> then you got to serve a whole other meal. Mine is after breakfast. Uh, what do you think? 
She's 1201. I was just 12, gonna say 1201. 1201, and that's when you just turn <laughs> the music the off. Lights. Yes, exactly. So whose party are you coming to? Which what? sister wins? Is it appropriate to hit two parties? Yes. yes. Here's yes. what I think. Party hop. Here's what I think. I think uh, eight to nine. Nine to ten, and then back and then to at ten o'clock. And then you're at ten o'clock. I'm at home. No, you're back. I'm at ten o'clock. I am at home because I'm probably asleep at ten o five because I was up at three a.m. Good point. Ladies, thank you so thank much you. for having us. And for a list of all these recipes, please go to our website at yourmorning.ca.